We're really sorry about what happened and that someone lost their life. It's, it's very tragic, very sad, and we feel for the family of the deceased. And at the same time, we, um, we are in shock because we felt the whole time that it was in self-defense that Nevis Betancourt acted and um, therefore... Why would you say it was self-defense? Because from what we have heard from the witnesses there is that Nevis was never at the restaurant. He was called out to come and approach this guy, to come after this guy. Well, what, um, from what we have heard and know so far, he, was, he went to the restaurant to visit his mom and with a gun. Well, apparently he has a licensed firearm. Yes. This is something he just walks around with. Yes, he walks around with a licensed firearm. Mm -hmm. So um, he, um, I, I, we have a photo of his arm, and his arm was almost chopped off. Mm -hmm. And after his arm got chopped off, that is when we are made to believe is when he took out his firearm and started shooting well he first shot a warning shot and then after that some more things happened his mother called him he went there and he asked who is this guy and then he approached the guy that's the story that we've been told so the theory of self-defense a lot of people are saying it's it's not true he didn't even know this guy he attacked the guy well a lot of those things i wasn't there i think and the public has a lot to say. I think the public wasn't there, so um, I will refrain from saying much regarding the whole situation. Nevis believes it was, it would have been his life, and he's very sorry, and we would like to say sorry to the family of the deceased. We wish this had not happened, but there's not much we can do now, and we just wish the best for everyone.